Hello Pisces, welcome to your bonus love reading. Let's see what messages will show up for you Pisces. What do we have for you? Pisces, this is a, a collective love message for your sign. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation, okay? Let's see, Pisces. What do we have for you? Mm -hmm. One more, please, for mutual energy. For Pisces and this connection and this person. Okay. Show me mutual energy, please, for Pisces. For Pisces. Consequences. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, we have forgiveness. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Very interesting energy. So in this reading, Pisces, we are connecting here with someone who might withdraw their energy, who might, uh, who might be acting, you know, distant. Or for instance, if you are, in t if you've been in touch with this person, you might um, notice that contact it's not that intense as it used to be. You might kind of um, notice some sort of changes the way they the way they talk to you or something like this. There is a change when it comes to this person that we are connecting in this reading for you uh, in their behavior. We, on their side, we have time apart. I feel for some of you, it might be a case that this person walked away or they would draw their energy again. Mm. Thirty-three, thirty-eight, twenty-nine. Those numbers might be quite important. Maybe it's someone's age. Um, but I feel that there is no contact situation. You're coming from a completely different place here. Your energies are completely different. That's what I wanted to say, Pisces. You have commitment. You want commitment with this person. Mm -hmm. and then mutual energy is consequences what I am getting here and I will be completely honest with you Pisces I feel that something happened between the two of you and it feels like both of the parties uh, it's not I don't want to say it's here to blame but it's like both of the parties contribute to, to this current situation it might be a case that there was a conversation certain things were said uh, it was very passionate exchange of opinions you know maybe there was an argument or there was um, disagreement and you know because of that kind of a uh, energy of that sequence of events that's why we're having here this consequences card and that was like that essentially is like a consequence of, of that situation that someone here on their side we have that like they withdraw their energy and we have a commitment on your side you willing to or you want this this connection to work out Pisces mutual um sorry overall energy we have a forgiveness so I'm seeing this person coming back if they withdraw their energy and if there is no contact between the two of you uh, they're coming back asking for your forgiveness. So this is a strong energy of reconciliation. Uh, this person I pro most probably will want to, or they want to because we are just reading energies. I feel that this is something with the number one, as you can see here, this is something that they manifest. And very inter interestingly enough, I put this energy next to this person's energy. So <laughs> I feel very strongly that this is them coming and trying 
uh, this person will try to make amends. This is something that they want to manifest. They're thinking about it. They are manifesting it. And I feel that this person will want to exchange the olive branch. They want, they want to apologize, say sorry. And they want to admit something here. Bottom line is that this is someone who wants your forgiveness. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what Tara will tell us about this situation. Show me this person's energy that we are connecting in this reading for Pisces. Show me their energy towards Pisces and towards this, co this connection, please. We have a high precious your energy mm. seven of wands six of cups yes show me more Ten of Cups, King of Pentacles, one more please, mm -hmm. one more for Pisces, and we have a Four of Pentacles. King of Wands. Okay. So we're starting this, you know, reading with regards to this person's energy for for you, Pisces, with your energy. High Precious is a Pisces energy. This is someone who's thinking a lot about the situation. They really, really do. And they're thinking a lot about you. I feel there was an instant, some sort of kind of a situation. And they acted in a kind of defensive manner. They didn't want to talk about something with the Seven of Wands. And they pushed you away. They just didn't want it to talk about this situation. There was something like this is showing up here that for some of you... Uh, you might resonate with that situation. And I feel that you just wanted to get the bottom of something because with the high precious, there is a lack of knowledge with regards to very, very um, significant situation. And I feel that you were starting to ask in questions, trying to get to the bottom of it. And this person uh, pushed you away. They said something here. And they might even said, oh, you are too pushy. You know, you just, you are too... You just, you are keep on asking me this, keep on asking me, I, I, I am unable to give you an answer now. Could you please stop or something like this? I'm going to be perfectly honest. This is what they, I'm seeing. It doesn't mean that you were, of course, but that's their perception because it's their energy. Then we have a six of cups and ten of cups. This is someone here who is coming back with the six of cups. It doesn't have to be an ex. Pisces, okay, it might be someone, for instance, that you that you've been dealing. Um, you might have been in a situationship. For some of you, you might have been in a relationship, but um, at the moment there might be an no contact situation. And if indeed there is this time apart that this person is facing, I don't feel that they are having a good time. This is someone who is missing you because you are in the first card. You are opening day reading here. So this person is thinking about you very, very, very much, if I can say it that way. Six of Cups represents this energy of the past. This person wants to come back. This person now is reminiscing a lot about uh, beautiful moments that both of you might experience in this connection. They are very much missing your warmth, your love, your care, your support. And... 
I'm seeing them coming with an energy of Ten of Cups. This person has love for you, Pisces. This person has love for you. They want a long-term relationship based on happiness, joy, mutual understanding, love and fulfillment because that's what the Ten of Cups represents. It also represents family, of course. Um, um okay so when i looked at these cards for some of you i'm seeing a very specific situation okay it might not resonate with all of you uh but i am seeing here that for some of you you might have asked this person if they want to take this connection into the next level you might even confront them and say listen you need to tell me if you want commitment with me uh, because, uh, for instance, you might say, I, I want to have a family. Uh, I'm thinking about, you know, children. I want to, uh, I want, I, I see us being together as a family unit. And this person just kind of reacted in a certain way. And that's why we have consequences that it's a time apart. It's like you, and then you might feel, I feel Pisces that you might kind of see them as they got cold feet, you know, uh, that might be, it was too much or it was overwhelming for them. But Hey, look, we have a King of Pentacles. This is very specific. It might not be a case, but if you re resonate with this specific message, you can see here that this person, uh, that you might be dealing also, you might be dealing with another Pisces. It's all about stability at the end of the day, because King of Pentacles, he represents stability. He represents someone who is loyal, who is reliable, who is there to support and who is there in a time of need. And, and it's, it's ready to, to provide this help that it's very much needed. So they are showing up here, someone who wants to be supportive and who is actually supportive of, 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 of your, of your view regarding this connection. It's like, I don't know, for some reason, it might be a case that they pushed you away, that at the moment, it was maybe something like, um, you know, they just, suddenly they felt very overwhelmed or, or something like this. But then we have a four of pentacles and this four of pentacles shows that this person doesn't want to let you go. This is someone who wants stability. and who wants this connection to work out. And I would say more, this is someone who wants to take this connection into the next level. It might be a case that that sort of conversation or consequences of some sort of kind of uh, confrontation here opened this person's eyes. This time apart that it's showing up on their side opened this person's eyes. And actually they've realized what they truly want and they want stable loving relationship with you and they it feels like they're going nowhere they want to stay in your life and create it with you but i feel that at the time this person maybe was caught off guard i don't know it's that's the right expression but you know what i mean it was like unexpected and suddenly they reacted in a certain way with the seven of wands it's like they felt that they are cornered and they, 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 they didn't want it to say anything. And they I feel that they said something that pushed you away. At the bottom of the deck, we have a king of wands. This person is very ambitious. You know, you might be dealing with someone who is very good looking or who has this kind of charm, like an X factor thing. And, um, but king of wands with queen of wands, this is a pair that it's, 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 I mean, it's a, yes, we can say that it's a pair of, that represents people who are um, very charismatic, very magnetic, very um, ambitious, very passionate, and they might be, uh, you know, quite good looking, uh, let's say easy for, easy to an eye or for an eye, sorry <laughs> for my English. Okay. Okay, and I feel with this King of Wands as an overall energy for this person is that they, they, 
they want this you know it's like a spark of creativity suddenly uh, kind of somewhere appeared when it comes to this idea because you have someone who wants to be with you who wants to create uh, something stable something very stable based on love and happiness easy for an eye i think that's that's the right right expression okay let's see let's see pisces let's see your energy towards this person and this connection please show me pisces energy towards this person and this connection we have a ten of swords We have a six of pentacles this person disappointed you with the ten of swords indeed some indeed something might have happened uh, there was some sort of form of detachment ending between the two of you we have a knight of swords yeah i feel there was a uh, there was a conversation mm -hmm. seven of cups yeah page of cups and the sun for some of you it, it might be indeed about future of this connection with regards to children the empress at the bottom of the deck beautiful energy so pisces uh you might be dealing with leo i also have your energy so you might be dealing with another pisces indeed uh, Taurus, a Virgo, Gemini. I feel this person with the Ten of Swords, they really disappointed you. And at some point you might felt that uh, this person kind of uh, metaphorically saying stabbed you in the back. Um, they betrayed here your trust. It's like you didn't expect this, expect you didn't expect this person to kind of react in a certain way and i feel it was quite not quite i feel it was very very emotionally painful and there is this kind of also energy i feel that you are coming from the place that this person um kind of um maybe they came across as ungrateful you know because with the six of pentacles i feel that you were very generous or that you are very generous for this to this person generous with your time uh, with your affection with your support it gives me this vibe of someone who is a very good listener who is there for another person in a, again in a time of need for the, and and it's just there because they coming from the place of you know it's like i really want to help you i really because it's like we are a team and and you know i just care about you because I want you to feel good because that will make me feel good as well you know that kind of energy and when we have this knight of swords to the moon and seven of pentacles seven of sorry seven of cups the moon with the seven of cups is a major energy of confusion not knowing exactly what's going on not knowing where you stand with someone, not knowing what this person truly wants, what they're thinking about, what are their plans. And also with the moon, there is this kind of underlying energy of, oh, you know, suspecting that something might be off, that this person might be wishy-washy, that might be lying, you know, that sort of kind of thing. Because the moon energy in tarot brings doubt. And seven of cups, it's more confusion it's more confusion for some of you might felt that because this person reacted in a certain way you took it as they might like keep their options open they might like to keep their options open and and with the knight of swords i feel again there was a confrontation of some sort of kind of a communication because knight of swords is this kind of energy of rushing in in order to gain some sort of understanding and clarity about certain matter and i feel certain things were said and i feel that you've addressed this confusion that this person brought and you might came you know uh, and i feel that you, you 
you are coming from the place this and you need to tell me because you might even tell to this person I don't have a luxury to waste my time I need to know I would like to know what it's in store for us then we have this page of cups and the sun I'm getting again this is a strong energy of that that this 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 conversation might involve children for some of you it doesn't have to be the case but I can see that for some of you the Empress you know is this divine feminine energy male female please take it how it resonates but uh, when I see the Sun the, the the page of cups with the Empress it's like the, this kind of a motherly energy very caring very nurturing so it might be a case that you know that also kind of was mentioned here if 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 it's not the case uh, with the page of cups and the sun i feel that you do have feelings for this person at the end of the day with the sun um and with the empress i feel that you see expansion and growth in this connection but but this person here needs to clarify what they truly want they 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 if they've been acting in that kind of wishy-washy manner they need to stop doing this and it feels like that they are coming here with this forgiveness you are very high vibrational pisces your energy it's your it's really high because the empress is just it's that's it you know there's nothing higher than the empress it's divine feminine energy and this person needs to match your energy here page of cups yeah expect some sort of kind of a news from this person but that will make you feel happy okay because the page of cups it's that kind of very nice energy energy that represents that good news on the horizon that will make you feel nice and happy and with the sun very very happy because this is one of the nicest and the sweetest card in the deck that represents ultimate happiness fulfillment joy that is essentially for instance like you've been waiting let's say that someone is waiting on the message and uh, some sort of communication or outcome or decision and they are receiving this uh, let's say letter or, 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 or message and if they have the sun it will be like jumping up and down saying yay I got this I'm so happy that that's this energy <laughs> of sun that sun is bringing and also what it's worth emphasize is that we have the moon and the sun so this uncertainty and clarity sorry this uncertainty and doubt that might be at the moment present or you know that discussion was about uh, will 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 gain clarity because Sun put a light into uh, put a light on some sort of situation and in this case uh, this this moon energy something here will come to light okay there will be enlightenment uh, and it is all because of that page of cups energy that message that's going to change everything when it comes to this connection and suddenly this this energy of confusion uh, will disappear let's see the outcome let's see the outcome you might be dealing with Leo, yeah. Show me the outcome for Pisces, this person and this connection, please. We have a five of cups, we have the devil, and we have page of pentacles. At the bottom of the deck, we have a nine of cups. I can tell you here one thing. Pisces you will get what you want because that's the overall energy nine of cups nine of cups it's a card of manifestation but manifest this is a very precise because magician represents manifestation but 
it is like just overall energy it's it's you manifesting so many things in your life when it's a magician present in your reading that's the, the, the that's the sign with the nine of cups you're manifesting your dream something that you truly want and you might be focusing on okay so this is very precise and we're talking here about this particular situation and i'm saying that at the end of the day you will get what you want with this nine of cups you will get what you want we have a five of cups on this side this is someone who's missing you who is missing you terribly here they are full of regret. I feel this is someone who kind of realized that they uh, reacted in a kind of reckless. Uh, they said things that was completely unnecessary and they are regret that this is someone who is uh, who is uh, full of regret and they are very sad that this connection at the moment might be facing difficulties. That's why we have forgiveness because they are coming here. With the with 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 um, with an apology, five of cups is um, it represents sadness. This is someone who is missing you, a longing for you. In the middle, we have the devil energy. You might be dealing with Capricorn. Okay. Uh, it feels very strongly here that this is a very very st strong energy i feel that there is a very special bond between the two of you uh, and um, i feel pisces that both of you and i'm going to be very honest both of you are thinking about each other a lot because this person have five of cups on their side uh, this is someone who is, I would say, obsessing over you. They don't want to let you go. They don't want. So, for instance, if there is no contact situation, you can be reassured that this person will communicate. They're coming here with, with, with an offer of, of an apology because um, they're stuck on you. This is someone who realized that, that you are their person. They, want, they, they are full of regret that they said something, that they acted or that they came across or they kind of... Uh, Mm, give you some sort of impression they come up they coming with reconciliation big time and again it doesn't have to be an ex it can be but it doesn't have to be i don't i don't get that very straightforward i'm seeing just a situation uh situationship let's say it that way ongoing situationship that at the moment might be facing difficulties. And yes, from day part, we have this time apart. This is someone who might have disconnected or there is a no contact situation. But I feel you do want this person. The devil here represents, because you know, this is, um, there is something toxic, but there is something toxic about this person here and i feel that they this you didn't hear with someone who feels who is aware that they are making over and over again the same mistake because five of cups next to the devil represents someone who uh, it's something to do with the past and this past is holding back this past is this past is holding them back and um and it's like they are aware of this but you know for instance they are caught in a moment and they are repeating here a certain pattern this person has to detach from that sort of mindset they have to you might be thinking maybe with someone who uh, who speaks before they think you know they i feel they acted in a in a in a kind of in a certain way maybe they said something again they didn't think you know kind of re reckless manner they yeah something like this is showing up but you can be here reassured that this person doesn't want to let you go they don't they are stuck on you here pisces and on your side we have this page of pentacles Page of Pentacles again, it's a potential. I feel this is someone, it's coming from their from side. You can expect message, 
uh, this phone call and this person here will will offer you uh, will will try to kind of uh, come across as they have a solid offer here and I feel this this solid offer it's it's all about this apology and them actually recognizing that you're right this is someone who will say you're right I was I was wrong that's what they that's what I'm getting because they want you they want you they want you but they need to change they need to change some sort of habit the way they react on certain thing and at the end of the day Pisces you will get what you want from this connection so you can expect that this person will come forward and um, it's like certain things will gain clarity and y your wish fulfillment here will be will be granted Pisces I will leave it here thank you so so very much for being with me please like share and subscribe and once again thank you very much for your time I truly truly appreciate you Pisces have a fantastic and beautiful day love and light till next time take care bye